Did you know that nearly 60% of men misread a woman's arousal signals, often assuming interest where there is none or missing cues entirely? According to research published in the Journal of Sexual Medicine, recognizing the subtle physical and emotional signs of arousal is key to healthy sexual communication and deeper intimacy. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to read these signals, like a urologist trained in the science of sexual health. Welcome back to my channel, your go-to source for medically-backed advice on men's health, intimacy, and relationships. I'm Dr. Georgia Bennett, a practicing urologist, and in this video, we'll break down the science of female arousal, from the tiny physical changes you might miss to the emotional cues that are just as important. If you want to improve connection and intimacy with your partner while understanding her body in a respectful, research-backed way, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. Let's dive into the science of reading her arousal signals. 1. Understanding Arousal Physiology Understanding female arousal starts with the biology behind it. Many men assume that arousal is purely psychological, but science shows it's a complex interplay of hormones, blood flow, and nervous system activity. According to research published in the Journal of Sexual Medicine, arousal in women involves both genital and non-genital physiological changes that can occur even before she consciously realizes it. When a woman becomes sexually aroused, blood flow to the genital region increases, causing the clitoris to swell and the vaginal walls to lubricate. This process, called vasocongestion, is similar to how men experience erections and is triggered by the autonomic nervous system. A study in physiology and behavior found that these changes can be subtle and often unnoticed unless men understand the signs. For example, vaginal lubrication may start even before obvious physical cues like pelvic movement occur. Hormones also play a critical role. Estrogen, testosterone, and oxytocin all influence sexual responsiveness. Estrogen increases blood flow and sensitivity in the clitoris and vaginal tissues, while testosterone contributes to sexual desire. Oxytocin, often called the bonding hormone, enhances emotional intimacy, making her more receptive to arousal. A review in Frontiers in Psychology highlights that the interaction of these hormones affect not just physical signs, but also her emotional readiness and responsiveness. Interestingly, arousal is not only about the genitals. Heart rate, breathing patterns, and skin temperature are also involved. Studies using physiological monitoring show that during sexual arousal, women often experience increased heart rate, faster breathing, and subtle flushing of the skin, particularly on the chest and face. These signals can be excellent indicators of arousal if men know what to look for, even before she expresses desire verbally or physically. Another fascinating aspect is the brain's role in arousal. Neuroimaging studies have revealed that sexual stimuli activate multiple brain regions associated with reward, emotion, and attention, including the hypothalamus and amygdala. This means that arousal is deeply tied to both mental and emotional states. Psychological context, such as feeling safe, respected, and emotionally connected, can amplify these physiological responses, while stress, anxiety, or distraction can suppress them. Finally, it's important to understand that every woman's response is unique. The timing, intensity, and combination of physiological signals vary widely, which is why careful observation and attunement to her cues are essential. Misreading these signals is common, which is why nearly 60% of men struggle to accurately interpret her arousal cues, according to Journal of Sexual Medicine. In short, female arousal is a symphony of biology and psychology. Recognizing the subtle physical changes, understanding hormonal influences, and considering the emotional context allows men to respond thoughtfully and respectfully, creating a more connected and fulfilling sexual experience. 2. Behavioral and Physical Signals While understanding the biology of arousal is critical, the next step is learning to recognize the behavioral and physical signals women display when they are aroused. These signals are often subtle, and research shows that men misinterpret or overlook them more than half the time. According to a study published in Archives of Sexual Behavior, careful observation of posture, movement, and touch can provide accurate insights into a woman's sexual interest. One of the most reliable indicators is body posture and positioning. Women who are aroused tend to adopt open, inviting body language, leaning slightly forward, angling their body toward the person they are interested in, or subtly exposing areas of skin, such as the neck or arms. 
crossed arms or legs can indicate tension or disengagement, while a relaxed and open stance often reflects receptivity. Another clear signal comes from touch and proximity. Women may initiate light physical contact, such as brushing against the arm, playful nudges, or lingering handshakes. A study in the Journal of Sex Research found that women who are interested often increase the frequency and duration of touch as arousal rises. Even seemingly casual touches, like resting a hand on the leg, can indicate a desire for closer physical or emotional connection. Facial expressions and eye contact are also strong cues. Sustained eye contact, dilated pupils, and frequent smiles can signal interest and arousal. Research from evolution and human behavior demonstrates that women who are aroused unconsciously mirror the body language of their partner, a phenomenon known as behavioral synchrony, which strengthens connection and signals receptivity. Another clear signal comes from vocal changes. Studies in hormones and behavior report that women's voices often become softer, slightly higher pitched, or more playful when aroused. These subtle changes in tone are usually subconscious, meaning they're authentic signals that can guide a partner in understanding her interest and readiness. It's also important to pay attention to gestures and movement patterns. Fidgeting, playing with hair, or shifting position toward the partner can indicate arousal, particularly when paired with other signals like touch or eye contact. Small adjustments in posture, leaning closer, or opening the torso are often nonverbal invitations that men can learn to notice and respect. However, context is critical. Not every smile, touch, or gesture indicates sexual interest. Research emphasizes that arousal cues must be interpreted in combination and within the context of the situation, considering comfort, environment, and emotional connection. Misreading a single gesture can lead to confusion, which is why observing multiple signals together is more reliable. By learning to recognize these behavioral and physical signals, men can respond more sensitively and appropriately. It's not about guessing or assuming. Science shows that understanding and respecting these cues leads to stronger intimacy, trust, and mutual satisfaction in sexual relationships. 3. Psychological and Emotional Cues while physical and behavioral signals are easier to observe, female arousal is strongly influenced by psychological and emotional factors. Science shows that emotional connection, trust, and comfort often play a larger role in arousal than physical stimulation alone. According to research published in the Journal of Sex and Marital Therapy, women who feel emotionally safe, respected, and connected to their partner report higher sexual responsiveness and more frequent positive arousal signals. One of the most important psychological cues is attentiveness and engagement. Women often demonstrate arousal through increased interest in conversation, asking personal questions, laughing at jokes, or mirroring the partner's body language. This mirroring, known as behavioral synchrony, has been linked to increased sexual receptivity and stronger emotional bonding. Men who pay attention to these subtle signs are better able to respond in ways that deepen intimacy. Emotional vulnerability is another key indicator. When a woman feels comfortable enough to share her thoughts, fears, or fantasies, it reflects trust and a safe emotional environment, both crucial for arousal. Studies in Frontiers in Psychology show that a positive emotional connection amplifies physiological arousal, meaning her body responds more strongly when her mind feels secure and engaged. Nonverbal emotional cues also matter. Subtle changes such as relaxed facial muscles, soft laughter, or leaning closer can indicate arousal in response to emotional intimacy. A study in Archives of Sexual Behavior highlights that women are more likely to exhibit these cues when their partner demonstrates empathy, respect, and emotional awareness. Ignoring these signs or focusing only on physical signals can reduce responsiveness and intimacy. Interestingly, stress and distraction have a direct impact on arousal. Women experiencing anxiety, stress, or preoccupation often display fewer physical signs of arousal, even if the desire is present. According to hormones and behavior, cortisol, the stress hormone, can suppress genital blood flow and lubrication, reducing visible cues. Men who recognize this can focus on creating a relaxed and emotionally supportive environment, which indirectly increases arousal.
Finally, emotional cues are highly individualized. Not every woman shows arousal in the same way, and context matters. A partner who is attuned to her personality, preferences, and emotional state is more likely to interpret signals accurately and respond in ways that enhance intimacy. Misreading or overlooking these psychological cues is a common reason why many men fail to recognize arousal even when physical signs are present. In summary, female arousal is as much psychological as it is physical. Paying attention to emotional engagement, comfort, and trust alongside observable behaviors allows men to respond thoughtfully, deepen connection, and create a mutually satisfying experience. 4. Contextual and Situational Awareness Understanding arousal signals isn't just about reading physical or emotional cues, it's equally important to consider context and situational factors. Research shows that environment, timing, and mood significantly influence female sexual responsiveness. According to a study in the Journal of Sexual Medicine, a woman's arousal is often heightened in comfortable, private, and low-stress environments, while it may be suppressed in public, rushed, or high-pressure settings. Recognizing these contextual cues can help men respond appropriately and avoid misreading signals. Environmental comfort plays a major role. Simple factors like lighting, privacy, and noise level affect arousal. Women are more likely to display subtle signals like gentle touch, leaning closer, or increased eye contact when they feel safe and unobserved. Even small distractions such as an uncomfortable room temperature or interruptions from others can dampen these physical and behavioral cues. Being mindful of the setting shows respect and can help her feel at ease, allowing arousal signals to become more pronounced. Timing and mental state are also crucial. Studies in hormones and behavior highlight that arousal fluctuates depending on the day, stress levels, and mental focus. A woman may be more responsive in moments of relaxation or emotional closeness, while stress, fatigue, or anxiety can suppress both physical and emotional cues. Men who understand this can avoid misinterpreting a lack of response as disinterest and instead focus on creating a supportive environment. Social and relational context matters too. Research indicates that women are more likely to show arousal signals when they feel emotionally connected, respected, and valued by their partner. This means that prior interactions, such as shared experiences, meaningful conversations, and consistent respect for boundaries can enhance arousal cues. Conversely, conflicts, unresolved tension, or disrespect can mask or diminish signals even if desire is present. Cultural and personal factors also influence how women express arousal. Studies in archives of sexual behavior note that some women may be more reserved due to upbringing, social norms, or personal comfort levels. This highlights the importance of contextual sensitivity, observing cues without assuming sexual intent, and always prioritizing consent and emotional safety. Finally, combining situational awareness with knowledge of physical, behavioral, and emotional signals allows men to interpret arousal cues more accurately. For instance, a subtle touch paired with relaxed posture in a private, intimate setting is a stronger indicator of arousal than the same gesture in a crowded, stressful environment. Understanding context helps avoid misunderstandings and builds trust, intimacy, and respect. In short, female arousal is context-dependent. By paying attention to environmental comfort, timing, relational history, and personal preferences, men can interpret signals more accurately and respond in ways that enhance connection and mutual satisfaction. 5. Common Misunderstandings and Myths even when men understand physiology, behavioral signals, and context, it's easy to misinterpret arousal cues, often leading to confusion or discomfort. Research shows that nearly 60% of men struggle to read female sexual signals accurately, Journal of Sexual Medicine, which is why understanding common misconceptions is critical for healthy intimacy. One of the biggest myths is that physical closeness or touch always indicates sexual interest. For example, a hug, brushing against someone accidentally, or playful teasing may simply reflect comfort, friendship, or affection rather than arousal. 
A study in Archives of Sexual Behavior emphasizes that context and combination of signals matter more than any single gesture. Assuming intent from isolated cues can lead to miscommunication or boundary violations. Another frequent misunderstanding is confusing emotional intimacy with sexual arousal. Women often show warmth, attentiveness, and closeness in response to emotional connection without necessarily feeling sexual desire at that moment. Neuroimaging studies in frontiers in psychology highlight that the brain's reward system can activate in response to trust and bonding alone, producing cues like laughter, eye contact, or mirroring behavior that men may misread as sexual interest. Vocal and facial signals are also commonly misread. Soft laughter, playful teasing, or a gentle tone may indicate comfort and engagement rather than sexual arousal. Research shows that while these cues sometimes accompany arousal, they are not reliable indicators on their own. Men who combine these with other physical, behavioral, and situational cues are far more accurate in interpreting her interest. Another myth is that arousal is always visible. Many women experience internal physiological arousal, like increased blood flow, heart rate, or clitoral sensitivity, without displaying obvious external signs. According to Journal of Sexual Medicine, subtle changes like slight flushing, minor shifts in posture, or small variations in breathing may occur, but they can easily be overlooked. This explains why some men mistakenly think a lack of overt signals means disinterest. Finally, assuming uniformity across women is a common pitfall. Every woman expresses arousal differently, influenced by personality, cultural norms, past experiences, and comfort levels. A behavior that signals arousal in one woman may have an entirely different meaning in another. Studies highlight the importance of observing multiple cues, considering context, and prioritizing verbal communication to avoid misunderstandings. In conclusion, recognizing these myths and misunderstandings is essential. Female arousal is multidimensional, subtle, and context-dependent. By combining knowledge of physiology, behavioral signals, emotional cues, and situational awareness, and avoiding assumptions, men can respond respectfully, accurately, and in ways that foster trust, intimacy, and satisfaction. Now that we've covered physiology, behavioral signals, emotional cues, context, and common myths, let's talk about how to put this knowledge into practice. Observe, don't assume. Pay attention to multiple signals at once, posture, touch, eye contact, and emotional engagement. Misreading one gesture can lead to misunderstanding, so combine cues for accuracy. Prioritize comfort and consent. Arousal is strongest when a woman feels safe and respected. Ensure the environment is comfortable, avoid rushing, and always respond to her verbal and nonverbal boundaries. Respond gradually. Once you recognize arousal cues, mirror her energy rather than forcing physical intimacy. Small steps, like gentle touch or closer proximity, allow her to guide the pace naturally. Enhance emotional connection. Emotional intimacy is a major amplifier of arousal. Share meaningful conversation, show empathy, and engage in activities that foster trust and bonding. Communicate. Asking simple, respectful questions about what she enjoys or feels comfortable with can strengthen intimacy. Research shows verbal feedback improves sexual satisfaction for both partners. Journal of Sex and Marital Therapy. Applying these tips ensures that your responses are accurate, respectful, and mutually satisfying, turning understanding into meaningful connection. Female arousal is a complex blend of biology, behavior, emotion, and context. Key points to remember. Physiological cues like lubrication, clitoral swelling, and subtle body changes happen even before conscious awareness. Behavioral signals, such as posture, touch, eye contact, and vocal changes reveal interest, but must be interpreted collectively. Emotional and psychological factors, including trust, comfort, and bonding, are powerful drivers of arousal. Context, environment, timing, and personal history affects the visibility and strength of these cues. Misinterpretations are common, so combining all these insights with communication and respect is essential. By understanding and responding to her arousal signals thoughtfully, men can enhance intimacy, trust, and sexual satisfaction, building a deeper and more connected relationship. 
If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe to Dr. Gorgia Bennett for more medically backed advice on men's health, intimacy, and relationships. Knowledge is power, and in this case, it leads to better connection, deeper trust, and more fulfilling intimacy.